Hey everybody, Kenny Tech with Money Box Realtors getting back into the groove here with our video blog series. I apologize to you, we haven't been uh, where we needed to be and, and getting you out regular information. Kind of hard to get back after the holidays. I don't know what it is about uh, taking a little bit of time off, but it just seems like we never get back in the groove. But uh, I promise you I'm going to do a better job of that. Um, and one of our last posts, we promised that we were going to do a series on uh, uh, basically a buyer seminar. You know, what do you think that you need to know um, as you get ready to buy a house? And uh, um, a couple things have happened here lately that are, are making me really want to get in gear and do that. Um, the uh, Mortgage Bankers Association has reported that for the third week in a row, mortgage applications for purchases have actually gone up. Um, that's a little bit of an oddity because historically this time of year, closing in on Thanksgiving, Christmas, and New Year's, that, that slows down a little bit and, of course, picks right back up in January. Um, but that is a good sign that, uh, that folks are ready to get back out in the marketplace. Also, uh, uh, Treasury yields have, have gone up, and I don't want to get into a big economic lesson um, about that kind of stuff, but the thing that you as a potential purchaser or even a potential seller need to know is that as Treasury yields go up, so do interest rates. There is a signal in the marketplace that uh, investors um, are getting out of the ultra-safe, ultra-cash investments, which causes interest rates to rise. And uh, um, that is a signal that they feel like demand is increasing. Of course, we know oil prices have gone up, uh, uh, and that is another signal that people think that demand is increasing. Actually, all in all, those are good signs that, that there may be some economic recovery coming. Um, what does that mean for you, though? That's, that's where the rubber hits the road, and what it means for you is interest rates are going up. So, uh, one of two things happens. Either your payment goes up on the type of property that you want, or you're able to buy less house for your money. So, if you're thinking about getting into the real estate market, you need to kind of get a move on right now. Uh, it would appear that even though there's going to be some political squabbling going on, that the tax rates are going to stay the same for next year. So hopefully that will encourage you that uh, there may be a little more disposable income. And it appears that the Social Security reduction will, uh, a Social Security tax rate reduction will actually be a part of that bill when it's finally signed. Uh, so that's good news too. Puts a little bit more money in your pocket hopefully puts a little bit more money in the pocket of your employers or encourages them to get out and hire. So, we will do as we said, and starting Monday, I'm going to give you uh, kind of a buyer seminar in, uh, in little three-minute bites or so in video blog format. So, stay tuned with us. Watch that. Hope that uh, it's information that you want to have.